hello guys welcome back to engineering sound in this video tutorial i will explain most useful and most important lisp to use in autocad for the dimension it's very important let's keep in touch and watch the video up to end the link i will give in the description you can download it from the description so let's start the video suppose for example if you have different type of shape like lines circles arc triangles any kind of shape and you want multiple dimension on this or you want separate dimension on this you can use this list it can be help you let me draw some shape here like circles on the corner on the last corner line end of the lines and suppose we need to enter a line here okay enter and let me extend this line up to here so it will be easy to explain very well okay guys uh, let me draw some arc here okay i wanted to draw uh, the arc on the end of the line so we can also use it this arc okay let's click this arc and i wanted to draw on this end also an arc okay any kind okay let's change it a little bit here so it will be look pretty good okay now this is our shape and here what we will do we will upload our list that is you can download from the description i will give the downloading link but don't forget to like share and subscribe my channel okay let's go to upload you can up use the ap command or you can upload from the manage okay now we will search our lisp or locate where is the location of the lisp okay here is okay let's select this one and load once check it it's successfully loaded and now we will use the lisp okay the command for the lisp is i n t l e sorry i n t l e m if if you use m in the end it's mean for the multiple if you use just only i n t l e n it's mean you can select single single okay and if you enter the m at the end you can use it for the multiple shape like that okay you can see here the dimension is displayed separate separate on the separate portion of the shapes okay let me delete this dimension and i will put some line here in the center okay uh, let me put some line okay suppose one line here and one line here in the center okay uh, enter okay now we will check it again use the same command i n t l e n m for the multiple m in for the multiple click here you can see it separate from here to here is 9.25 and this you can see the arc length here here separate length okay for the separate portion in the shape it will provide to you the different dimension so you can use it select it similar all okay we did we need to do it. just go to the unit and you can change here the precision from here suppose you need to 0.20 0 after 0 0.20 and put it again the same command okay and enter now you will see after point is there is two digit three five you can use it two three four as per your requirements okay so let's i uh, think we need to change a little bit the shape and size of the text so it will be good to select this one i am doing this because if some new viewers they can understand how to change the text size or anything so you can suppose if we need to do uh, the separate separate we can use it i n t l e n only we will not put at the end m just n okay and you can select it partially suppose if you need this one you can select this and again if you need this one you can select this one okay 
it will not give you completely it's will be in the partial okay and you can select it this one and all is here the dimension is here you can see it okay so let's delete it so which i told you that i will do some text setting text size so it can be help for the new viewers text size t e x t s i z e you can enter text size suppose let me check six but it will be big just i want to explain go to the same command and click here it's very big okay let's delete the and control z you can use for the control z to come at the same okay text size let me put 1.5 okay 1.5 and press enter let me check again i n t e l k n m enter and click here you can see now it's look pretty good okay okay dear fellas we will see in the next tutorial i hope this video is helpful for you we will see in the next tutorial goodbye and take care